How you communicate with your prospect can make or break an emerging sale. You must figure out how the consumer wants to communicate and then make sure you're doing it in compliance. Consumers are communicating via this device and uh, whether it be iPhones or Androids more and more. And this is a big shift that's going on as we speak. Uh, dealers can capitalize on that by communicating with consumers in which the way they want to communicate. So let's face it, there's a lot of dealers today texting consumers. Uh, it's a little bit like the Wild Wild West in many ways because dealer personnel are running around the dealership with cell phones. That information's not being uh, pulled over to the CRM. There's no documentation of those conversations. And should that salesperson leave the dealership, uh, all that history is lost. So it's very important that consumers uh, talk to dealers and dealers talk to consumers in a compliant manner, meaning that that consumer's opted in and meaning that that consumer has the chance to opt out at any given time. Uh, because if a consumer opts out and the dealer continues to contact that consumer, that's where these lawsuits that you're hearing about come up. So $1,500 per infraction sounds scary. A lot of dealers would probably just rather not even deal with it, um, with those kind of consequences. But it's important that uh, they do look into it, and that's where we come in. Uh, we can definitely help out. Uh, we had an acquisition of Q4 in 2013, a company out of Pennsylvania, Advanced Mobile, and they came up with a technology, a secure platform in which you can speak to consumers. All that information's logged, pushed to the CRM, uh, but most importantly, it hits on these two variables, uh, these two very important variables that you need to meet in order to stay compliant, and that's having an opt-in and giving the consumer to opt out. So through TechShield, the consumer has the ability to contact the dealership through their mobile site. Uh, we can even put the code on the desktop site. Uh, so it enables the consumer to text in and the dealer texts back and then there's a two-way communication, again, that's uh, in the secure platform that syncs the CRM. The nice thing about it is the dealership is communicating with these consumers in which the way they want to communicate because initially to start the conversation, the consumer has to text in to begin with. So it's unlike a common misconception, we're not going into our CRM and we're not just going to start texting all kind of people. For all we know, we're texting landlines, which gets very dangerous. That opens up a whole other ball of wax. That's not what we're saying here. We're saying give the consumer the option to text in. Those who choose to text in, which would be a lot, is what we're finding. We're simply saying we're giving you a safe and secure avenue to communicate back to that consumer and do it in a compliant manner.